fear. Fear murdered my parents. On the far side of the world, I tasted fear in its purest form and thought I had conquered it. But fear followed me home. Got arson. I've alerted the fire department, sir. You should be able to find an exit to it, I think. Not until I find Crane. What the? The back! About the gimp. What about him? Is he gonna leave him locked up while this place burns? What? Hell yeah. Crane's got the poor bastard gassed out of his mind. Tear our lungs out if we took him off that chain. I say let him burn. Put him out of his business. Hey! Hey! Here come. Fascinating. 
I'd kill for a look inside your head. But luckily, I've got my patience to do that for me. It was the same, the same fear that made me become In the darkness of my parents' murder, I caught a glimpse of something I've been looking for ever since. I lost myself in the world, searched in all the shadows. I seek the means to fight injustice. To manipulate the fears in others, you must first master your own. Are you ready to begin? Nagari, Mostali, Kalifal, Maksura Nune Gune Pashatiye. Raz al Ghul says that if you want to be Death's journeyman, you cannot fear it. Ready or not, Death does not wait. Death is not considerate or fair. And make no mistake, in this chamber you are facing death. Do not return to this room until you are ready to join the League of Shadows. This way, Wayne. There is no space in the League for hesitation. You've already tempered your fists. I know you understand violence, but anger alone will not win your battles. The ninja is thought invisible, but invisibility is largely a matter of patience and distraction. Attack one of the three men before you. Show me you have the wisdom to be ruthless. Wayne, if you run, you will be discovered easily. Stealth is your greatest ally. Enemies with weapons are the most dangerous. Always attack them first, without mercy. Excellent, Wayne. Destroy the strongest of your opponents first, and others will fear you and fall in the mercy you deny them. We'll carry on. not have come to this place if you were seeking out the easiest path. This way is barred. Find another way through. 
There are more ways around a door than a key. Throwing weapons are a ninja's hand, not his fist. By them, a man alone may surround and confuse his enemies. Shuriken, wait before you. Take them, and I will train you in their use. Shuriken, wait on the far side of those flames. Ninjutsu will make you invisible and immortal in the minds of your enemies, but you will still be nothing but a man. Mind your surroundings, Wayne. Every gift is a potential trap. Look around your environment for opportunities, Wayne. Your environment will only work to your advantage if you make it do so. Use the shuriken to create a path before you. Can't enter there until you have completed one last challenge. Follow me. In the room beyond, you'll find your next to final test, one of intimidation. The three ninja in the next chamber have been instructed on pain of death to keep the passphrase from you. Don't make your presence known until you've become a wraith in their minds. I've left you a gift in the room beyond. Use it to convince them you are more terrible than death, and they will give you the words. Use the wires above to cross without alerting the men below. Did Ducard tell you what to expect? Quiet. I don't trust Wayne. He's not one of us. There is a violence to him. All the more reason for silence. Use your environment, Wayne. Break the support cable with the shuriken. Show them fear. out of his mind. He's one man and still in training. We can handle him. Now, Wayne, we are ready. Weak with fear. Finish him off. You know what I want. Please. Don't. The guard would kill me. And I'll make you wish I would. What's the passphrase? Please. It's looking glass.
welcome. Welcome, Wayne. We have come to your final lesson. Lower the prisoner in his cage. Excellent. Now, come here. We have purged your fear. You are ready to lead. Ready to become one of the League of Shadows. But first, you must demonstrate your commitment to justice. He is a murderer and a thief. He cannot be allowed to live. No. I'm no executioner. You must have the will to act. Or you are not fit to lead these men into Gotham. Gotham? As its favorite son, you are ideally placed to strike at the heart of criminality. That city has become a festering wound of suffering and injustice. It cannot be saved and must be allowed to die. You can't believe in this. Wayne, what are you doing? What needs to be done? On a full way! You will die. <laughs> Al Ghul, the League of Shadows. They were nothing but ashes now. My mentor had shown me everything I could find without losing myself. So I left a card behind. I came back home. I'm going to show the people of Gotham their city doesn't belong to the criminals and the corrupt. As a man, I'm flesh and blood. I can be ignored. I can be destroyed. But as a symbol, as a symbol, I can be incorruptible. I can be everlasting. What symbol? separate him from his thugs, but he's arranged for a police presence as well. No doubt corrupt, sir. I still can't attack them directly. I'll need a way around. I'll search Gotham Records for an alternative route. Mother of...
what are you? You're one of Falcone's men. What's he doing here? Please, you don't know Falcone. He's horrible. I'm here. He oh. isn't. And I'm worse. What's he doing? <laughs> Smuggling. Shipments come in from Southeast Asia weekly. Falcone cuts them up, hands them out to his dealers, but... Keep talking. Something's different this time. Something's happening in the sewers. And Falcone wouldn't start pulling favors with the cops unless he was... Unless he was what? <laughs> Scared. from police radio on boats? Yes, sir. Gotham police have at least one squad of marksmen on the water. I wouldn't suggest putting yourself within their range. Then I'm gonna need access to the sewers. I'll mark the nearest entrance point on your radar, sir. You guys are already back there. Yeah, I'm coming. We'll put some hustle in it. Falcone wants us on standby in that van. You don't like to ask twice. If I may, Master Bruce, the number of men waiting in that van may be too great a force for even you to take on single-handed. Only if it's a fair fight. That forklift might shift the odds a little more in my favor. Got Falcone on edge. What, what, what in the name of Falcone brought a small army for a simple cargo drop. What's he afraid of? I don't know. I, I think something's happening in the source. How do I find Falcone's shipment? Bears. I'm gonna need more than that. Inside of stuffed bears. It's how he's done it for years. I don't know anything else. to test the tensile strength on the grapple. The 
Could it be dangerous? The advantages are worth the risk. It gives me a higher vantage point and the drop on my enemies. Very sensible, sir. What's going on? Just put down the gun, all right? I can't do that, Mac. Just let me through and you never see me again. Couldn't even if I wanted to. Uh, I don't have the key. And how the hell did you get over there? From the far side. Listen, I don't know what you guys are doing, but if I don't seal off the main valve, we could have a real disaster on our hands. Your problem... <laughs> the Batman! <laughs> What are you? I'm here to help. I need to get deeper into the sewers. What's going on down here? These tunnels are filled with our men and now you... Whatever you are. I don't have time to explain. None of us do. Nobody's supposed to be here. The only reason I am is to survey for tomorrow's repair crew. The release valve on the dock's steam pipes rusted shut. If anybody opened up all the feed pipes, the whole system could burst. Would anybody be hurt? Probably not, but it would be pretty dramatic, and real expensive. How do I get to the feed pipes? There's a door behind you. The keypad code is my anniversary. 1227. You're not gonna do anything crazy, are do you? Do I look like I'd do something crazy? Where you are is as safe as you're gonna get. Keep your head down and wait for dawn. Ah, oh, man. I should have called in sick today. I have a feeling that Wayne Enterprises will be writing a check tomorrow to the Gotham Water Authority for steam damage. Just leave me a blank place to sign. And the feed pipe valves? There are three of them. I've located them on your radar, sir. I wish you'd hurry up and get the rest of it down here. Whatever's going on with these pipes is freaking me out. You and me both. It's no news to anybody that the docks offers rock, but insisting on taking the shipment through the sewers is a new level of paranoia. I've heard rumors that the doctor's half of Falcone's shipment ain't recreational. Yeah, there's all sorts of talk going around. All I know is, the sooner we're through with the job and out of here, the better.
Hey, Andy said you saw what was inside one of the rabbits. Yeah. So? So what? So don't be so mysterious. What is it? You got me. Not the stuff Falcone pushes. What did it look like? White, like powdered sugar. The guy who split it open was wearing a face mask and rubber gloves up to his elbows. Sounds serious. Hey, you buy that boat yet? You kidding me? On a cop's salary? <laughs> yeah, I bought the boat. Me and the wife are taking it over to Coast City next weekend. Nice. How about you? What are you doing with your bonus? Eh, I got an ex-wife and three kids in college. You want to talk about robbery? Yeah, thank God and got him for Falcone's piggy bank. What would the law do without him? So what's with the rabbits? Because Falcone can't just ship in clear plastic baggies. He's got the cops in his pocket, not the whole damn city. But I thought bears were his thing. They are. The rabbits are something new. The bears are standard powder. They go straight to the dealers. And the rabbits? They go somewhere in the narrows. What does that mean? That's all I know. I tried to push further. Falcone told me not to stick my nose anywhere. It might get cut off. Falcone's bulls, aren't you?
Alfred. I need encryption prefixes. Right away, Master Bruce. You should be able to get into the machinery systems now. He's playing his cards close to his chest. Whoever he's working for has got him spooked. Somebody knows. His advocate, his, you know, what do you call him? Consigliere. He'd know. Falcone tells him everything. How do I find him? He's the only guy in the docks in a $500 suit who's not Falcone. What scares him? I don't know. Falcone. Small spaces. He could tell you everything. What are you doing over here? Sorry, what do you mean? Ain't you supposed to be Falcone's right-hand man? I had to get some air. They went down to the ship's hold, and I'm not, uh, comfortable with small spaces. Uh-huh. You know anything about Falcone's guy in the Narrows? I heard. It would be best if you didn't ask. Sure. Whatever. your worst. You'll get nothing from me. You're wasting your time. No, no, please let me out. The walls, please. I, I, I can't stand this. You come out when you talk. Please, anything. Just let me out. I want to know about bears and rabbits. It's how Falcone smuggles his shipments in. The bears go to dealers, the rabbits are something new. What are they? I don't know what's in them. It's serious. They go to some guy in the Narrows. What guy? I don't know his name. Falcone's more secretive than he's been about anything before. He's some kind of doctor. I think he works at Arkham. How do I find Falcone's shipment? It's mostly been divided up already. <laughs> Please let me out. Falcone's shipment. How do I find it? White Falcons. They're spray painted on his crates. I I can't. I can't. That sounds like evidence. Falcone's crates. Exactly. I believe a large number are in the hold of the container ship docked nearby. Perfect. May I ask, sir? 
Perfect for what? Something dramatic. Something he can't hide. Hey, buddy. You talking to me? Nobody else here. I must be talking to you. That's funny. You got a light? Nah. What time, neither. You one of the doctor's guys, right? What do you want to know for? Just curious. The whole rabbit and bear thing don't sit straight with me. Or why a loony bin head shrinker is all of a sudden interested in uh, drugs that ain't exactly medicine. Those ain't healthy. Any closer, and I'll kill you! Smoke grenades and other fear devices are only theatrics, Master Bruce. You'll only work on enemies already in a state of fear.
the hell is going on? Yes, sir. And somebody get on the horn to Peleg. I want my boat here, now. Get me the hell away from this disaster. Mesa Falcone is being protected by a small army and a large arsenal. A forward attack may be too great a risk. This isn't a matter of force. Falcone's been beaten before. He knows he can always get back up. I want to get close. Show him my nightmare. Show him there's something on these streets more frightening than him. And how exactly do you intend to get close to him? Outside of using force? I'll bring him to me. That crane. Very creative, sir. One could almost believe that you enjoyed this. What in the name of...
Too. They said it was some kind of creature, something like a man, but it couldn't be stopped. Anything that walks can die. I'm happy to prove it to any man here. Where's my damn boat? I call, but... Well, call again. Get down to the pier. Row the damn thing in if you have to. Yes, sir. I don't want to see your face again on dry land. You understand me? Perfectly, sir. What are the rest of you standing around for? Get your guns out of your holsters and your heads out of your rifles. Anything more... Yeah, it's Doug. Where the hell is Pelig with the boss man's bow? Hello. Dear Lord, don't kill me. I need to get through that door. I, I have the key. Please, just don't hurt me. What's Falcone afraid of? I don't know. I just work for the guy. But I, I heard he doesn't like heights. I'll turn myself in. Just let me go. I don't know, man. I don't see it. It's out there. You can count on help. What about all those cops? Forget about it. Everybody knows the guy from PD is as dirty as a brothel's outhouse. What if it's the Coast Guard? They can't be too copacetic at Falcone's imports. It ain't the Coast Guard, it's the cops. And they're deeper in Mr. Falcone's pocket than lint. We got nothing to worry about.
intercepted a signal from Falcone's boat, Master Bruce. I'm afraid you only have a few moments before it docks. Yeah, still nothing, man. Thought I saw a shadow for a second, but that's all it was. Hey, yo, you read me. Is anybody next to fuck? Leave that superstitious crap for the Bush Leagues. I want to know who he's working for and how I can hurt him. I'm not going to keep playing errand boy while that white-collar geek crane barely lifts a finger. What in the name of... What the hell is going on? Somebody help me! What in the name of... Get me down from here! What are you staring at, you slack-jawed morons? Lower this damn thing! Ah! What? What the hell are you? I'm Batman. We've got Falcone at the scene. Drugs, prints, cargo manifests. This bat character gave us everything. That's your nocturnal. Bats may be, but even for billionaire playboys, three o'clock is pushing it. The price for leading a double life, I fear. Bruce? But it's not who you are underneath. It's what you do that defines you. I found an ally and a resource in Lucius Fox and Wayne Enterprises Applied Sciences Division. So what do you think? Does it come in black? Sir, I have the recording of Lucius Fox's message from Wayne Enterprises. Thanks to Earl's love for bureaucracy, we've got no idea what they stole. But whatever it was, it was big. They pulled it off on a big rig with a small army of cars running interference. So I'll need to take down that freight truck. Destroy yes, it! But you'll have to get through its fleet of escort vehicles first. And I'm afraid they've hijacked the narrow power bridge. You won't be able to get to it before they've raised it. That doesn't mean I can't cross it.
they won't make it. Drive that thing into the scrap heap. I've got the Wayne Enterprises job. I'm almost there. I'm being chased by some tank. Get ready for me. He's firing on us. Faster. Lucius Fox on it. We need to find out what the missing weapon is before all of Gotham figures it out the hard way. was Falcone working for? What were the drugs and where were they going? Gordon's partner, Detective Flass, would know. You think Falcone will be in the pen long? Nah, the guy's got a bank account full of get out of jail cards. Yeah, but we got a few days peace and quiet anyway. Batman! What, what are you? I can use a hand over here! You know that! What the hell kind of costume? Like a church mouse. Did you find the GPD files? Of course, sir. And despite the enforced sabbatical you so kindly gave Falcone, the club remains quite active. You'll certainly find Detective Flass inside. How do I get in? You'll need a passphrase at the entrance. It changes daily, but the character such as Secrets Keeper would suggest that any number of the local gentlemen would likely share it, if properly persuaded. Just let me up. Not without the magic word. It's Jeff, you know me. We used to run birds on 10th Avenue. Without that passcode, I don't know you from Adam. Get lost. But something's wrong, something big. Sounds like a damn mortar landing. Fascinating. What's the passcode? I told you, man, I don't know. Then go play in traffic. <clears throat> huh. 
How do I get upstairs? You're... you're real! I, I don't know! I don't know anything! If I let you live, what are you gonna do? Whatever you want me to do! Tell your friends what's come to Gotham. I'll tell them! I'll tell everybody! Oh. Is it like, uh, cook things? How the hell should I know? All I did was drive the truck. But it's a microwave weapon, right? That's what the guy said. Some kind of Wayne Enterprises military thing. What would Falcone want with something like that? Falcone's toast. He didn't have nothing to do with it. So who are we talking about here? I don't know. Somebody new. Somebody serious. How serious? Serious enough that I'm finished talking about it. did that. Holy crap! How did that happen? Keep your panties on. It was probably just an accident. Did that look like an accident to you? We're good as dead. Shut up. I'm trying to listen. <laughs> what the? Yo, he was just here. That's impossible. He can't have just vanished. Be so bold, sir. If you don't leave any of these men conscious, no one will be left to interrogate for a past phrase. <gasps> is little pig what about the microwave emitter what a microwave weapon you were driving a truck when it was stolen from Wayne Enterprises that's all I don't know nothing more about it Little pig, let me in. You got it. something that may be useful, Master Bruce. 
Detective Gordon has an informant inside the market. Is he still inside? Undoubtedly so. And according to his information, Falcone has the building covered with security cameras and booby traps. Where can I get a look at those camera views? It's a central security center, sir. Then that's how I find Flash and the traps both. Gas. It looks like I just found the first of Falcone's traps. It appears so, sir. And unfortunately, Gordon's files indicate that they are triggered by infrared beams. They won't be visible until you trip them. This, uh, bat creature? He can't be real. They, they, they talk about him like he's some kind of demon. I don't know, man. I heard some of Falcone's enforcers talking about it. None of those guys have a sense of humor. Falcone's old news. Gotham PD nailed him. Nah, it was the bat creature. They say he becomes a demon when you're most afraid. That's just the chemical garbage we've been handling for the doctor. <laughs> it's messing with our minds. I don't know, man. How many people have to have the same nightmare before it's real? so nervous about that's the second alarm in 10 minutes could be bad What are you supposed to be? Flash. He's in a separate building. Ah, that 
could be problematic. How so? Gordon's files show that the only access to the neighboring building is via Falcone's office. Apparently, it's reserved strictly for less savory activities. Looks like Falcone's office is occupied. The gentleman in Falcone's office is likely Gordon's informant. A certain Walter Feister. If so, he'll undoubtedly know how to gain access to the elevator. Then I'll have a talk with him. I've put a data tap on the system. The security cameras could come in handy. Of course, sir, but a word of warning. It appears that Feister is not alone. Maybe I'll give him a little privacy. I may, sir. I've relayed the nearest security video to your onboard system. Do the cameras have an infrared wavelength? Yes. The Vantage should allow you to see and avoid the trigger beams.
another alarm. And Pauly never came back. You think it's trouble? I guess I'm gonna find out, aren't I? I need to get next door. I'm looking for a crooked detective named Flass. You, you work for Falcone? No. I'm a hell of a lot worse. How do I get next door? Don't... don't hurt me. There's a construction job. I don't think it works anymore. But that door will get you to it. The security code is 1337. You ratted out your friend. I just saw an angle and used it. Please. I don't deserve to die.
I don't know, man. I might have had enough. You always say that. Not like this, I don't. I'm out of here. What, the market? The market, the life, Gotham. Get leaned on by Falcone was bad enough. Now that he's gone, things are just getting worse. You ain't been handling that blue powder, have you? I heard it messes with your head. Nah, nah. I'm not getting anywhere near that doctor or his damn chemicals. I'm getting out. I'm through. Abandoning ship? Exactly. Time for the rats to swim away before this city sinks. No go on that. Falcone likes keeping that door locked. Anything to keep a messy business at least a little discreet. You can get through with the digits 1024. Burn this once you've memorized the code. We don't want it getting around. Emmett. Hey, Master Bruce, the heat and force resistance of your body armor does have its limits. You're telling me not to blow up anything I'm sitting on top of? Precisely, sir. I think Flash knows he's in over his head. Flash has been dirty since forever. He knows how the game is played. Things been shook up, though. Falcone's down, this mysterious doctor suddenly stirring the pot. We got whatever that bat thing is on top of everything else. Gotham's always been a sewer. Yeah, maybe. Getting a lot stranger, though.
so steep. Van stopped. There's definitely somebody in there. Why don't you go check? Me? But you're the one with a gun. Exactly. And I'm telling you to go have a look. Forget that, man. What if it's that bad thing? I'd rather get shot. I'm calling for help. If there's enough of us, we can take anything. Scared of you, Zaz. You'll learn. 
Who is Crane working for? I'll leave you your time so you can live. Who's Crane working for? Come on, please. I'm warning you, Zaz. Just a little bit. I want to smell you. Mother. You know, I got connections in Arkham. I can make things real uncomfortable when you're back inside. You've got no idea what's inside Arkham. Whoa! Suffer in hell! Jeez. What? What? Somebody's trying to kill us? Calm the hell down! Fat freaking chance of that! Uh. I don't care what you are! Everything dies. Oh my! You're trembling, detective. Don't let him kill you. Bats! Get him away from me! Don't be scared, Flash. Come over here. I'm going to take care of you. You're trembling, detective. Oh, detective. This is gonna be some sweet hell. Don't hurt me. Why would I? That's what Zaz is here for. Let's get me alive. Yes, slowly. And I don't want to have to watch him do it. So I hope you're feeling talkative. What do you want to know? Falcone split his shipment in two. Only half of it was drugs. What was the rest? Some kind of chemical. Something hidden. It goes to the Narrows. To who? An, an, an Arkham doctor. His name's Crane. Jonathan Crane. What's the chemical? I don't know. I swear to God. Swear to me. Where is Crane? The Narrows. I don't know where the doctor is, but the toxin's being relayed from the abandoned science museum. If you find the chemical shipment, you can find Crane. Alfred, I'm outside the museum. There are reports of a helicopter on the roof of the archive warehouse, directly behind the museum. If it was that bad thing, he's long gone by now.
head's got to be worth something. Forget the dinosaur, man. It's a plaster cast. Besides, how the hell would we get that? We could figure out a way. What's going on in here? We're supposed to be next door. Are you kidding me? This place is a gold mine. Look at all this stuff. It's got to be worth millions. Don't be an ass. Where are you going to find a fence willing to move a dinosaur skeleton? Um, he's got a point, Mark. That didn't kill us. That wasn't luck. I need help. You don't want to mess with me. Dumb as a post, but all right. What happened? You didn't hear? Tom dosed himself. With what? That's the thing. Nobody knows. With whatever Dr. Crane's been getting smuggled in. He's like that from some drug? Yeah. But he's been like that for a week now. Yeah. I don't think he's getting better. Batman, please, don't eat my soul. That's a new one. Where's Dr. Crane? I, I don't know. He's keeping everything under wraps. Whoever he's working for has got him spooked. Who does know where to find Crane? The pilot. There's an Arkham pilot on the roof. 
He's moving the toxin from Crane to us. He can lead you to him. What's the toxin? What's Crane planning? I don't know. Some kind of poison. The guys who've been handling it have been seeing things. They don't sleep. They talk about demons and boogeymen. Who's Crane working for? I don't know. It's not Falcone. I don't know anything else. Sounds like I need to have a conversation with that helicopter pilot. If I may, sir, so long as he has a clear escape route, what reason does he have to talk? Right. I'll handicap the helicopter first. Make sure he stays put until I tell him otherwise. Coming. That wasn't an accident. There's something out there. We don't know that. How can you even doubt it? That was aimed at us. That was aimed right at us. It's that bat thing. Shut up, man. What? <laughs> Anything about this uh, bat creature? He can't be real. They, they, they talk about him like he's some kind of demon. I don't know, man. I heard some of Falcone's enforcers talking about it. None of those guys have a sense of humor. Falcone's old news. Gotham PD nailed him. Nah, it was the bat creature. They say he becomes a demon when you're most afraid. It's just the chemical garbage we've been handling for the doctor. It's messing with our minds. I don't know, man. How many people have to have the same nightmare before it's real? Something's up. Oh man, oh man. I don't like this. How could that have happened? I can't handle pain, man. 
How the hell does something like that happen? Let's get out of here. Where would we go? Hmm. Crap. You don't want to get it on your hands. Crane said it's not dangerous until he's processed it. You want to believe that? Tell it to those Frankenstein gimps in the red jumpsuits. Bald-headed things? Yeah, them. Have to keep their heads shaved so they don't scalp themselves. Should've given us gloves. I don't like waiting. What if the cops show? How long does it take you to get that bird airborne? Ten seconds, tops. So what are you worried about? Any trouble shows, you're long gone. Doesn't mean I like to wait. Nobody's paying you to like it. We'll wait for my guy to show. Ray won't like it if the shipment comes in a bundle short.
be him. What do we do? What can we do? I don't know. your boss is. What the? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't work for anybody. Lies! You work for Dr. <laughs> Jonathan Crane. And you're gonna tell me where he is. I can't. Crane's got my brother in this hospital. Whatever you do to me, he'll do worse to Walter. If I let you go, leave Gotham. Don't come back. Never talk to Dr. Crane again. If he knows I'm coming, I'll know it was you. Okay! Whatever you say. I swear, you'll never see me again. Thank you. You won't regret this. That was unexpected. He's gonna try to use me as leverage to get his brother released from Arkham. I'll hitch a ride once the helicopter's airborne. He'll lead me right to Dr. Crane. There's a lack of mercy I expect from you, sir. called Mr. Fox when your condition worsened. He synthesized an antidote. I've felt these effects before, but never so strong. Patients suffering delusional episodes often focus their paranoia on an external tormentor. In this case, a scarecrow. Rachel's inside Arkham Asylum, trying to tie Dr. Crane to Falcone. I have to protect her. This is where we make the medicine. Perhaps you should have some. Clear your head.
Alfred, I need a way to get inside the asylum. Might I suggest donning a pair of tights and pretending you're a Batson? Cute. How do I get to Rachel? Miss Dawes is undoubtedly being held somewhere in the basement. Although I'd advise against a frontal assault, sir. The main gates appear to be well nigh crawling with Crane's criminals. A guy could start to think Dr. Crane's got a thing for us. What, is this place next? Yeah, but it's to room 45. Just storage. Probably some kind of a backup thing. <laughs> kidding me. What? You got a car alarm? I can't stand that crap. So don't touch my car. I haven't had six straight hours of sleep in a month because of those things. Got my nerves all jangly. I happen to like my car. Somebody wants to mess with it though. That car alarm's not gonna do a damn bit of good here. Think about it. There's nobody for a mob but lunatics and criminals. Just don't mess with my car is all. Now there's something there ought to be a law about. Robbing somebody, assault, at least that shows initiative. See what I'm talking about? We didn't do that. Somebody's here. Dr. Thomas, thank you for bringing your concerns regarding Dr. Crane's behavior to the board. Your allegations are indeed disturbing and, frankly, hard to believe, if not outright fantastic. Dr. Crane is a highly respected and longtime member of our staff. We hope that you have not made these accusations lightly and urge you not to make them publicly. Since the board does not handle interpersonal matters, I have taken the liberty of forwarding your note to Human Resources. I suggest that you thoroughly document Dr. Crane's alleged threats and behavior for your own protection, should legal action be required by either party. Regards, Doug Hunter, PhD. Two new messages. First new message. Emma, hey, it's Jonathan here. Listen, call me. I couldn't really make sense of your message, but if you think you're in danger, then get out of there. Seriously, call me. Second new message. This is a message for Dr. Thomas from Arkham HR. Your concerns about another doctor's experiments really are in our jurisdiction. We've passed them along to internal reviews. But we're happy to update your security code. Your new digits are 4563. Make sure you've erased this message once you've noted the code. security gate in my way. Yes, sir. Asylum plans show a more than adequate lockdown system in place. Can they be opened remotely?
Shut gate 17. Shut it. Now! One of Crane's gas-crazed freaks got loose. If only I had a cattle prod. Be a hell of a lot happier if Crane didn't insist on using those drug crazed gimps as his guard dogs. Yeah, like animals. Nah, you can scare an animal, control it. These things, though, I don't know what they are. Who do you think he sees, anyway? What, that poor bastard? Yeah, I don't want to know. Hey, do you know what Crane ended up? yourself. That thing shocked me a few hours back. No kidding. You're lucky it didn't fry you crispy. Sure as hell has enough juice to. Right. I'm luck all over. Sure. Hurry up and get it fixed. I don't like being out in the open like this. Don't rush me. I don't want to be here when that thing shows up. That whatever. Demon. He ain't a demon. It's a guy in a mask. Besides, we got Jason watching out for us. Who? Campbell? That guy couldn't see Christmas coming. Just get the sky like th in the Batman, do you? Nah. All I know is Crane's scared. Whatever scares him sure as hell scares me. What do you mean? The doc seems like the usual creepy neurotic. Look well, how many of us he's got here. Just watching the place, waiting for something bad to happen. Something big's going down and something bad's on the way. I guarantee it. Where did Campbell go? What? Campbell's gone. Jason! Jason, you there? Oh, crap. This is trouble. Calm down, man. You're making me nervous. You don't want to mess with me. Use a hand.
You don't want to end up like the other doctors, do you? No! No, please! Dr. Crane is a very private man. He doesn't like his, uh, research meddled with. I don't know anything, I swear! So what were you doing in the basement? I was... I was just lost. Sure you were. You weren't nosing around any canisters or nothing. No! No, I don't know anything about the toxin. It, it's just... I didn't say anything about a toxin. Please, I just want to go home. Your home's a cell now, Dr. Thomas. A red jumpsuit in the world All ahead. right, enough of this. Let's throw her in brain surgery and ask Crane what he wants. No, stay back! You shouldn't be here, Dr. Thomas. And you especially shouldn't have been poking around down below. I didn't see anything! Please, just let me go! Alfred, find out what you can on a Dr. Emma Thomas. She has information on Crane. Right away, sir. And I'll need you to locate the brain surgery theater on my radar. That's where they're keeping her. Done, sir. Gotta be something edible in Just this Just grab place. something and let's go. We got work to do. Give me a second. I just want to find something that doesn't look like my grand... Does anybody smell gas? If I may, sir, that sounds remarkably like a gas leak. That's it exactly, Alfred. I'm evening the odds. Hardly even, sir. May I ask how you intend to ignite the flame? nearly had a heart attack. You and me both. What the hell's going on here? I don't want to find out. Forget this. I'm in trouble! <laughs> the... ah! Ah! No! <laughs>
comfy in there, Dr. Thomas. Maybe you're feeling more talkative now? Believe me, you'd rather talk to me than Crane. Still feeling curious, feel free to sample one of those gas canisters. Give us a laugh. What was that? Somebody there? Stay put, Doc. I'll be right back. He disappeared. Alfred, what's my current position in relation to Arkham's power grid? Almost directly atop it, sir. Might I ask what you're planning? I'm gonna crack open that water tower. Use it to short out the power. Excellent idea, sir. Locate room 45 on my radar. The men at the front gates were talking about storing explosives. Right away, Master Bruce. Let no man underestimate your appetite for destruction. last well they're gone now that's just great Clarence shut up a second let me think
Asylum still has electricity. Those will be the backup generators, sir, which unfortunately have just enough power to keep the security gates sealed. Just enough? Precisely, sir. The asylum's electricity is cobbled together from a dozen jury rig systems. You'll never kill the power entirely. But if you activate enough systems at once, then you could overload it and create considerable chaos. Change is going on. He's here. Who? Oh, the Batman. What do we do? What anyone does when a prowler comes around. Call the police. Alfred, I need you to locate Arkham's circuit breaker boxes. The Asylum's electrical system is already in chaos, Master Bruce. It can always get worse. Never the optimist. You'll find them on your radar, sir. Alfred, I saw Rachel. She's alive. Can you get to her, sir? Not from here. I'll find another way. I swear! What's the holdup? Must be the lift's emergency brakes. I fixed the elevator. Uh, I mean, it should be working, but the release lever got stuck by the power surge. So unstick it. I'm not strong enough. Let me think. Oh! 
Hey, what's going on down there? Polly, you get this thing fixed? Polly, hey, Polly, I can't believe it. That scumbag left us hanging here. Polly, you get this thing fixed? Ow, my I'm gonna leg. tear you a brand new. That's not Polly. <laughs> Try to get this sorted out. Sort what? The electricity. The flickering lights. Feels like we're in a cheap slasher movie. Can you cover things while I'm gone? I can't look in two directions at once. Crane said we had to... You can handle it. I'll be back in a few minutes. You need to calm down. Start taking your vitamins or something. You look terrible. I know. I, I feel terrible. Listen, maybe I could hold on to the gun for a little while. Get out of here. Come on. It'd make me feel better. I'm not giving you the gun. But it would. Really? No. Get your own gun.
I can't see a thing! for Dr. Jonathan Crane. <laughs> You're gonna help me. Ah! Take it! <laughs> Take it! <laughs> Exactly. They can't stop us, but the Batman has a talent for disruption. Hold him off until they arrive, and they'll take care of him. What about the girl? I very much doubt Batman's arrival on her heels was coincidence. Grab her, follow me. Well, what about us? What about that bat creature? I heard he can fly. I heard he can disappear. We'll wait here for him. Find out if he can die. Let's go. for Dr. Jonathan Crane. <laughs> You're gonna help me. Oh. Take it! <laughs> Take it! <laughs> oh. Exactly. They can't stop us, but the Batman has a talent for disruption. Hold him off until they arrive, and they'll take care of him. What about the girl? I very much doubt Batman's arrival on her heels was coincidence. Grab her, follow me. What about us? What about that bat creature? I heard he can fly. I heard he can disappear. We'll wait here for him. Find out if he can die. Let's go. something else. Let's hope so. You check over there, and I'll watch here.
I don't know, man. I think I can feel something. You're imagining things. Crane says it doesn't work until it's a gas. You're telling me you don't feel just a little funny? Listen, we've been doing this for three days now. Gotham's water supply is thick with this garbage. If it made you crazy, every man, woman, and child in the city would be howling at the moon. I'll live. What the hell's going on? I don't know. I don't like it. This is bad. This can't be happening. Don't make me hurt you! You think that... spreading toxins into the city through the water pipes. I need a map. To trace the contamination, sir? No, it's too late to stop it. But I can use the sewers to get deeper into the asylum.
Of course he can be killed. What if he isn't human? He is nothing but a man exploiting your superstitions and your fears. You have him outnumbered and you know he's coming. Quickly. What was that? What if it's him? What if it's the Batman? You got a gun, right? Yeah, but I heard bullets pass right through him. I heard he can't be killed. I don't want to know. I shouldn't be here. Get a hold of yourself. One more step, and you're dead. <laughs> <laughs> the boss says you're just a man. <laughs> Necessary. My patience will see you. Overkill from Mandel Hospital, I know. 
But you'd be amazed at the garbage we deal with. Timely as always. Now, listen carefully. You and I are the sole survivors of Batman's lunatic rampage on the hospital. I saved your life, yes? The Batman tried to kill us all, and I saved you. The Batman. Who is he? What do you know about the Batman? Did he send you here? Who else knows? Talk, damn you. Not here to kill anybody. I need your help. She's been poisoned with a panic-inducing toxin. I'll take her to the medics. The medics can't help her, but I can. Get her downstairs. Meet me in the alley on the narrow side. What the hell is going on? Dr. Jonathan Crane. You'll find him in damn trousers in that office. He was the third man at the docks. Crane was smuggling his toxin hidden in Falcone's drugs. Refining and testing them here, then dumping them into the water supply. What's he planning? Who's he working for? I don't know. Someone dangerous. Get her downstairs. She doesn't have much time. Unit 4 
Harris, go, go, go! This area is clean. in the building. We'll get him. Get it all together. Ready? Hmm, no one here. Enforcements. On standby until we get reinforcements. Negative visual. Yeah, copy that. Switching to channel 9. I don't even know, man. This place is an absolute nightmare. I'm covering my own six. I plan on walking out of here at the end of the night.
Stay with me. I need you to be tough for me. I'll take her. Take my car. I brought mine. You've been poisoned. Stay calm. Uh, it's a black. Tank, turn off your engine. Step away from the car. Monster Bruce, it's Keep suspect it fleeing in black. Rachel doesn't have Tank. much time. 7912, we have Gordon is helping as he can, but you'll need to reach Gotham Battery Tunnel before it's blocked by a roadway. What about helicopters? Incoming, sir. If one of the onboard SWAT snipers hit you with a tracking device, escape will be impossible. All available units in pursuit. Dispatch, where's my riot van? Now, Gordon, we got the riot van incoming. I want that riot van to ignore dispatch. Take the Gotham battery tunnel. 79 on 6, in pursuit of suspects.
Rachel in my life again. So close to the things I have to keep hidden. I can't tell her. Crane was a puppet. Falcone too. Whoever's pulling their strings. Whatever it is that's coming to Gotham. Is Raz al Ghul immortal? Oh, his methods supernatural. Or cheap parlor tricks to conceal your true identity, Raz. Crane was working for you. His toxin is derived from our blue poppies. He weaponized it. But Crane knows nothing of the League of Shadows. He thinks we'll hold the city to ransom. Gotham will tear itself apart through fear. I 
taught you better than that, Wayne. destroy thousands of lives. Millions of lives. Gotham cannot be allowed to survive. It is the breeding ground for crime and suffering. Gotham is the heart of modern decadence and filth. We must rip that heart from our chest. There can be no mercy in justice. You've never understood that that makes you vulnerable. Gotham can be saved. Not this time. And all those dead innocents? Innocents? No. Sacrifices. Like your parents. Like you. Still not learn to mind your surroundings as well as your opponent. This isn't over, Dakar. My name is Raz Al Ghul, and for you, this is very much over. Goodbye. Coming to you. I'm by the grand piano, sir. Hurry. See the body. Then let's find that corpse. And I want to burn to death in this death.
must be close. Hold your ground. He may come this way. He must be dead by now. We don't know that until we see the body. Then let's find that corpse. I don't want to burn to death in this decadent sewer. Lucius, what are you still doing here? I was nearly killed by some maniac in black pajamas. You have to get out of here. We need to manufacture your neurotoxin antidote on a large scale. That would take weeks. We don't have weeks. The toxin's already been dispersed. It's in our water supply. That doesn't make any sense. The toxins are inhaling. Putting it in the water wouldn't work. Unless... What? Unless you had a microwave emitter powerful enough to vaporize the whole system. Kind recently stolen from Wayne Enterprise. Stay there! I'll find a way out for you!
Well done. Now save your own hide. Alfred, are you still alive? No, sir, but loyal as always, waiting by the piano. I'll be there. I hope you didn't rush your mic out, sir. Tomorrow the world will watch in horror as its greatest city destroys itself. Time to spread the word. And the word is... Panic. Follows the water maze to the central hub beneath Wayne Tower. Sir, there appears to be a panic about the narrow barrier bridge. There's a panic about the entire island. Ra's al Ghul's already vaporized the toxin. Of course, sir. But the crisis at hand is keeping it from spreading into Gotham proper. Someone is lowering the narrow barrier bridge. Mobs poisoned by Crane's toxin could spill into the city. I'll stop the bridge. I'll put the control tower on your radar. And the uh, Batmobile? It stays on the tracks. The monorail can't reach Gotham without crossing that point. If I can't stop the train, the Batmobile's auto-destruct is my failsafe. <laughs> Man, come to join my tea party. 
Oh no, Scarecrow. A few more minutes and the bridge will be down and Gotham will have so many more psychopaths than just you and I. I'm through playing games, Crane. Life is a game. So yes, maybe you are. Not human. Stay away. Don't come any closer. It's not happening. I'm not afraid of you. I'm not afraid of you. I'm not afraid. That sounded like the rather fine exit for Dr. Crane. Don't count on it until they drag the river. Mad. I'm going after Ra's al Ghul and the microwave emitter. I need any information you can find. Of course, sir. It won't move. We don't have time. There are two more barriers after this, keeping the monorail from Gotham. Then we'll use the explosives. All set. Blow the barrier. <laughs>
awesome. Hope you like that by dawn. Not if we don't get this barricade down. The detonator's ready. I need more time. If I see the monorail coming, I'm blowing the charge. Prepare to blow the barrier. We're not. Wayne is getting closer. We blow the barrier now. All Gotham will be alike. Not if we don't get dawn. this barricade down. The detonator's ready. I need more time. If I see the monorail coming, I'm blowing the charge. It's him! Blow the barrier! <laughs> All Gotham will be alike. Not if we don't get dawn. this barricade down. The detonator's ready. I need more time. If I see the monorail coming, I'm blowing the charge. It's him! Blow the barrier! All Gotham will be alike. Not if we don't get dawn. this barricade down. The detonator's ready. I need more time. If I see the monorail coming, I'm blowing the charge. It's him! Blow the barrier!
Is there a safe place you can hide? If there was, I would be there. I... Ah! Ma'am? Ma'am? Miss Dawes, can you hear me? Did you give my message to Detective Gordon? Have you found a safe place, Miss Dawes? There aren't any left. I'm in the monorail control station. Tell Gordon I know why this is happening. I've... I've seen the device. I can give your message to my supervisor. <laughs> They say you're not mortal. They say you can't die. How much you want to bet I can make you wish you could. <laughs> nice work. Talk therapy. You've seen the device that's causing all of this? Something they loaded onto the monorail? Yeah. I found the control station. They only have one train running. I think the tracks are blockaded to keep them out of Gotham. Not anymore. I need to get on that train. The monorail controls didn't look that complicated. I could probably stop the train long enough for you to get on board. I don't want you to endanger yourself. Nobody's safe until this is over. Wait! You could die. At least tell me your name. It's not who I am underneath. But what I do that defines me. Bruce? Alfred, patch into the monorail control station. To contact Miss Rachel? Right. I need to know when she stops the train. Of course, sir. But be warned, your father built those trains to be driven, not remotely controlled. She'll only be able to stop it for a few moments at most. in position. Come <laughs> on. 
You can't stop now. It's too late. Then there's no reason for you to suffer to protect him. Suffer or what? You're the one to find out. How do I disarm the charges? One, nine, four, two. That's the code. You'll live to see your precious Gotham of living hell. It's only moments away. Once we reach the center of Gotham, once we reach the Water Authority, there is no more Gotham. You're afraid. took my advice about theatricality a bit literally, don't you think? We both wear masks. But yours is a lie. You hate this city as much as I do, but you're afraid to do what's necessary. It's why you cannot fight injustice, and why you cannot stop this train. Who said anything about stopping it? Then you will die with the rest of them. There's only one man I'll let you kill.
necessary. I told you there's only one man I've let you kill. If not murder, what do you call this? Justice. Alfred, detonate the battle. Are you quite sir? Oh. It's our only choice. Blow it. I once made the mistake of thinking Ra's al Ghul was dead. But when men make themselves symbols, they shed their mortality. Henry Descartes and Jonathan Crane are already gone. Just like Bruce Wayne. He's only a mask. A cover for the face criminals now fear. All that's left is Batman. <laughs> 